God. Episode 25 starts off with a butt cheeks because my Boost Evo is dead. Who's that Boost Evo by? It's a limited edition by Sugar Sean O'Malley. <laughs> Dude, that sucks because... That does suck. Well, let's just give him a rundown. I, well, earlier today, Danny and I got home. I'm like, I need a sick pick. So we, we took an Insta pick with my Dr. Dabber in my robe, and, and uh, it was fun. And then Daniel was going to come over at 7 p.m., record this episode... And we're about to sit down and record this episode. Knock, knock, knock. You saw us at my door. Mm. Um, so then it took me, what, he's probably here an hour? Yeah. An hour to pee. It's like, I don't, I just pee, dude. Like, all right, let's uh, drink water. And a uh, super nice guy. Everyone from USADA has been nice. Um, what happens if you're not home? Do they? They call you. And they call you? Yeah, yeah. You need to be. The, yeah. It's and then, crazy. So say you were in Miami or something. I oh, have you have to, to put that, but I did uh, it, and I'm not good about it, dude. I don't think anybody is. Like I'm going to LA Thursday. I need to make sure I put that at you. I just got tested today though, but yeah, you're supposed to put exactly where you're at, pretty much at all times. Damn, it's crazy. Um, yeah. So were you a little nervous? He's kind of cute. Yeah, he was cute. <laughs> he low key cute. Um, yeah. So that sucks, man. I was gonna take a little dab, get my mind right. But apparently last episode, I was so goddamn high that I couldn't even formulate sentences. No, you didn't remember most of what we talked about. I know. I'm about. like, hey, should we talk about TJ Corey? He's like, dude, we literally just talked about that. <laughs> like, fuck, shit. Yeah, that was my <laughs> fault. I was way too stoned, man. Way too stoned. Um, who won the... Who won? I swear, I feel like I'm going to give this guy a sweater. Who won? Oh, the... Uh like the first me. comment, I took a screenshot of the oh, guy's name. It. I was surprised how many people said made it. Or did that? Did they know, like, huh, I wonder if that's the whole thing. I don't know. But uh, the first one that I saw, and I'm, when I scrolled through all the comments, Darren Sim. Darren Sim. He was the first one that commented, made it. Can you see that by time? Yeah, it was the uh, most recent comments, Damn. and that was the first Darren one I saw. Sim. And if Darren Sim loses... If he's like, if he doesn't want it or whatever, Anthony Divineer is next. But. All right. Uh, well, both of you guys message Daniel. Say, what up? Made it, bitch. It's me, Sugar Shane's cousin. And then put your name. <laughs> tell, him. Get, tell him. Tell him. Tell um, him. So they won. Or uh, what they win? The sweater. Yeah. The large. Um, oh, yeah. Even if you're not a large. Okay. Even if you're okay. not a large. See, you do remember. Yeah, you know, I remember. Did we talk about Schmitty getting his Xbox? I don't think we have talked about that he actually won it. Schmitty finally won his Xbox. You guys might have seen the video if you care at all. It's, it's pretty funny. You can't hear him good enough. It would make the video a lot more better. Yeah. He's like, I'm going to pass out. He was, he was so excited. He was so excited. <laughs> I'm sent, I, I kept it in a couple extra days. I made sure I, everything was updated, downloaded, I downloaded Warzone. So when he gets that bad boy, he's ready to rock with the boys. That's just one sent, benefit of subscribing to him on Twitch. That's true. Schmitty won an Xbox. Send him Byron that uh, Dr. Dabber tomorrow. Yep. Um... You know what I mean? <laughs> Joe Rogan explains the decision to interview Conor McGregor immediately after. Did you watch that? I just in UFC news. Joe Rogan talking about why he... No, I didn't actually watch that. I was, I was curious because he has... I mean, he's been interviewing people like when not, you broke yeah, your like foot. Knocked, got knocked out. <laughs> yeah, so I don't... I feel like that one's not any worse than... I don't know why people are upset about that. Now that that was whoa, that was that was messed up. Oh, I just saw that. Connor I was gonna. Tweet, COVID is good and father is evil. After Khabib tweeted, "Good always defeats evil." Yeah. Oh, whoa! Oh, that was whoa. Yeah, that was intense. He deleted it pretty quickly after, but I thought that was kind of a uncalled that for. Was, that was, but dude. It, I mean, that is uncalled for, but I, for me, I just look at the internet as entertainment. That's not good yeah. entertainment at all, at, by any means, but that makes me feel like, whoa, like it's like an entertainment aspect of the internet. That, that, that was fucked, but yeah. is that, I mean, he it's, deleted it. It's fucked because you know he, he kind of means it, like I feel oh, like yeah, when he dark, said that. Or, yeah, for like, sure. That's why I was like, it's not really dark humor because I think he kind of meant it. Like if if Demented. Some, demented. Whoa. He is demented. But... Damn, that yeah, was I saw crazy. That comment, I saw that tweet today, just like randomly, and I did. I thought nothing of it, and no. then I was like, "Oh, I thought something of it." <laughs> we got That's a couple crazy. other questions from Alex G. Notice how Sean and Kyler opponents moved up weight because of last second replacement. Do you think they were able to take so much damage because of not cutting that much weight? I think for sure. I think the kid I fought didn't cut a ton of weight, which means therefore I'd be the bigger guy. But uh. 
Do you think that would help? Kind of oh, with for, the dude, when you dehydrate yourself and then your brain fluids don't re, aren't back to normal in 24 hours, like getting hit in the brain after dehydrating yourself that much, dude, that makes you get knocked out way easier for sure. Dang, that's interesting. That's kind of crazy that they you still cut weight. Is that maybe an incentive <laughs> to cutting weight because they're better not? Well, dude, imagine if I, I weigh 156, 157 pounds walking around. If I'm like, I'm not going to cut weight. I'm going to fight at 155. Where you at, Dustin, Habib? Like, no, <laughs> no. you got to cut weight. Even if I went to 45, I could. Well, they're walking around at one. That's what I'm saying. But it's like you, you, both people have to agree on like, okay, let's not cut weight. You know what I mean? Right. We got one from uh, T.S. What up, tits? He said, I see your friends with Michael Guthrie. Can you show Sean one of his flipping clips? Have you seen this guy? He's uh, a Michael Gooch. Michael Gucci. Uh-huh. Um He's, dude. This guy, he does some of the craziest stuff I've ever seen. Well, sure. Are you gonna put this, put this on the so the people yeah, that see I it? Think I'll I'll do do it. To. He's a big fan of yours, but uh, he's just like a. I think that I don't know what it, it's like a freestyle martial art kind of vibe, but he does some crazy. Damn. Holy, dude! You know who can do stuff like that? Not that good though. Is Kyler? Can he, he does shit like that all the time at the gym. That's insane, though. Yeah, okay. Whoa, made me dizzy. <laughs> um, I've kind of talked about this, but what's your thoughts on the Gaethje declining Chandler multiple times? Also, who's your pick between Derek Lewis and Sir Gain and Aldo versus Moon? Moon. Munoz. Munoz. Uh, Pedro Munoz. Um, Gaethje just declined uh, Chandler? That's what, I mean, we kind of talked about it at the beginning. Yeah. Gaethje said that like multiple times, or uh, Chandler said that multiple times Gaethje declined was offered him. the fight and then... Gaethje clapped yeah. back and said, hey, no, like you got off. I wonder if Justin's like, yeah, it's just not the fight to make. So he probably turned it down. And then it's like, oh, you're a bitch. You didn't take the fight. That's just fight gossip. Uh, sometimes knows? it's not a, the right fight to make. Yeah. Maybe he's like, no, this is, doesn't make sense. I make business moves instead of I think ego moves. But Gaethje also came out and said that. Uh, Gaethje ain't going to fucking turn down. Gaethje would fight Francis. Exactly. Like, I'll give you five bucks. Sure. He said that they were waiting for Chandler to accept the fight, and then that's when Chandler took the fight against Oliveira. Mm. So he said it wasn't his fault. Yeah. And then, knows, man, that shit's crazy. The last question we got is from Su- Sweet Drags. What is up, Elena Rangers? taller than Cody Garbrandt? <sighs> give, her, give her three years. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that one was pretty funny. That I was silly. That was silly. Yeah, we were definitely, you said uh, in the comments, people said we were a little stoned last <coughs> last pod. Well, the pod before that, we were so stoned, we didn't record it. <laughs> we did a 30-minute pod, and his mic was off. At least we recorded those last couple. That would have been just an interesting conversation, just hearing me talk, well, talk to myself, basically. Yeah, that's what it was. Um, I've got my watch fitted today. Ooh, <sighs> dude. Feel cleaner? Dude. Now it's not, like, huge on you? No, it just... It's nice. It, t- it hugs me. It's like, I love you, Dad. Oh, that video was so sweet. 50 Gs, huh? He, I think it was 50 Gs, and I think they said in the video he bought it for 75 racks, right? No, I couldn't that. remember. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I Damn. Know. I know I took it into the watch place, and the lady's like, is this genuine? I'm like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but you felt pretty cool. I'm like, yeah, it is. It's not mine. <laughs> it's mine. Well, it is. Oh, my God, yeah, we walked out of this the watch store today. It was in the mall, and this guy come up, comes up to me, and his he, you could see his wife was sitting down on, like, a couch, and then his daughter, who was mm-hmm. probably, what, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, I don't know. Um, and she was sitting there, and he's like, my wife is just such a big fan. And she was sitting there going like this. <sighs> just breathe. <Really? laughs> just breathe. Like, freaking out. <laughs> That's I should have awesome. gave her a kiss. Did you take a picture I gave her a big her? hug and, like. Grab oh, her butt and stuff. I bet she's no, still talking right. about it. I no, bet. she was excited. It was fun. It was cool. It's funny that like, but when people just see me, like she probably literally has only seen me fight yeah. on TV. She probably never doesn't follow me on Instagram. She's like an older lady. It's like she probably literally just saw me fight a couple times on TV and was like, "Whoa, he's cute." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she might and have athletic. That. And athletic. She might have thought that. Might not have. Dude, do we talk about that land going about? For sale by yeah, the Sugar Factory had a whole Dude, spiel about it. I was a little high, man. I was a little high. Uh, people talk- were excited about that, though. The people Dude, said that'd be sweet. I got big ideas. I got big visions in my head about it, but I'm like getting, I'm like, let's just happen. Let's make it happen now. Buy it, buy it. That's buy just it. not how shit works. It's not even like, it's for sale. We've called like 75 times and nothing's came about from it. Ugh. So it's like, oh, and then you have to build a factory. 
But yeah, that'd be like see. a year process probably. Unless I get out there and help. Yeah, you are handy. I'm gonna go out there and start pulling weeds. <laughs> <laughs> you and mom. Hey, mommy. There. Um, what else happened today? Ooh, uh, Usman Covington. That. Oh yeah. To the rematch. Uh, that's, that's planned for. Fight. I think they said for November 268. Dude, come Dude, on. That was square. so good. Yeah. Pretty sure we FaceTimed Colby when I was in Miami now that I actually think about it. Really? Was it Murda? Fuck. Someone. I, I was very intoxicated. It was at the uh, at the restaurant. I'm pretty sure. We, uh, it's funny. But, dude. Oh, <laughs> um, Kamaru's so good. Yeah. He is. It's going to be. I just don't see anyone touching him again, but someone I, I read knows. something that Colby hasn't beat anybody in the top ten. Really, right? That they're in the top ten right now, which is crazy because Colby's dude. Colby's just as good as Kamara. Damn. That fight, last fight was so close. Yeah, uh, I'm excited for that fight. That'll be a it's good kind of far away, but I'm excited. And then for the, who's it too. the co-main? Amanda Nunez. Yeah, versus Pena, I think. Um, I think is that Derek Lewis or no? Uh, who just uh, Walt Harris versus Ty Tuivasa? My yeah. boy, Shuey. Shuey. Yeah, that, he just got another fight now. Oh, it's pretty dude, cool. but that's he's probably been drunk since the fight. You think so? Oh, yeah, I I hit him up in Miami, which was like eight days later. He said he's had not been drunk. Jeez, he knows how to party. Yeah, that's I want to party with him. That's October oh, maybe not thirtieth. Is it? Yeah. Where at? Um, I'm not sure actually. I don't have my oh, wait, no, it's not T-Mobile because the next fights because they wanted me to fight in New York, potentially. I was like, ah, Tim has um, trials, eighty like this big jujitsu tournament that weekend, and New York's taxes are just insane. So I probably won't probably won't do that. Probably looking at Vegas in December. Vegas in December? That's what I'm thinking. Damn. Sugar Sugar's next fights when? Vegas. That's a caption. Okay. Sugar next fight probably going to be December in Vegas against no nah, no nah, I don't kidding. I don't know we don't know right now we we really don't um just waiting any potential options don't we'll know. see yeah. we'll, we'll see I I don't know I haven't There's talked to uh, the UFC yet well my manager's talking to the UFC a lot of sweet matches but they, Tuesdays today is when they do their matchmaker meetings so I should hear something back soon. Dang, there's so many sweet matchups. It's gotta be. It's gonna be fun. Oh, whatever, dude, whoever the whole it is. bantamweight division right now. I don't. I know we talked about Corey TJ last fight, but I was, don't remember what I said. But dude, TJ impressed me a lot. Yeah. Going, I'm like, how? Because his cardio was always so good. I'm like, dude, you're you're cheating, dude. His he looked good. He looked sharp. He looked focused. He looked uh looked really good. Corey looked so good too. Both that that fight was so sweet to watch. Um, both of them looked good. I thought Corey might have beat him up more. Right. Um, TJ did grab him a couple times. Did absolute dude. If you want to think about who won the grappling exchanges out of all that, Corey tore his knee. That's true. Popped his off knee. his back, which you know you're on top, you're winning. It's not how this sport that that's not how that works. Um, have you rewatched it or do you? No, just kind of going from memory. No, I just rewatched my fights like 17 times. <laughs> I literally am cr- dude. It's weird. Last couple nights. Or no, probably like three days. I just I'm gonna, I need to rewatch it again, 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 and I get excited too. Do you? Oh yeah. I'm like, <laughs> when you go, when up. you watch it, do you watch it like to learn, or do you watch it just for like? An I, I see something different every single time I watch it. So you're kind of breaking it down in your head. Breaking it down, seeing all the sweet shit that I did. I'm like, damn, that was fucking sweet. Because I was watching DC's breakdown oh, of yeah, it on detail today, and that was Dude. just even though. <sighs> It was he wanted you to lose in a weird way. It was still cool. He still broke it down pretty decently. He did. He does a good job of uh, not showing. I feel like Big DC. He'll be happy if I lose. I I, I, can I just that. get that vibe from him every time he comments commentates. I feel your like fights. he sees me as a young John Jones. Like just fuck this. Just kid. arrogant. I think, but he sees that I have true skills. Yeah. And maybe he doesn't even want to hope that I lose. He just does. Yeah. You know how that is. He's just like, ah. But maybe. He, but he sees the skills. He sees yeah. the, the he sees the potential. Uh, maybe I'm completely wrong, but I just have a feeling. I, just, like, I mean, see, do you want to see me just get knocked out cold? He'd be like, no. <laughs> <laughs> he just can't help but bring up the Cheeto. Every oh, day. I know. The he Cheeto just, one. He'll, he'll do that every fight ever. Yeah. He, he, he's not undefeated. He says he is. He's not undefeated. But if you haven't, but seen he'll it, beat me up, so I'm not sure. Tri- <laughs> if you haven't seen it, go watch it. It was pretty cool. It showed it got a breakdown. Some ESPN ad. ESPN. 
find a link jokes yeah it's pretty cool dc breaking that down detailed a couple things he saw i was i was like oh yeah that's pretty good and then there's a couple ones i'm like you missed some important shit yeah i wonder if he had a time limit where he could only say a certain Maybe. amount of things because he did but the stuff he did he, good i think yeah. i thought he did like overall i thought he did a good job it was entertaining it was informative to some um it was good he was he wanted to show people how to beat you though he did indeed he yeah. was like if you guys are watching this and find sugar you know he does this <laughs> he's messaging all the top 15 bantam weights <laughs> watch this detail <coughs> yeah. i put out right now did i uh, oh it's still good no that's funny it's good stuff to do the bantam weight division right now i seen tj got let me look pull up let's see tj's ranked number two now right? oh is he i was wondering because i only i mean Corey was number so he two, was so. not ranked at all yeah. And that was, okay. I, dude, rankings, they I've always said it. I will forever say it. They don't mean shit. I've knocked this next dude out. I'm getting a title shot. <laughs> you heard it here first. Yeah, I know. I think that, I think it's fair to put him at number two. I mean, if he just beat Aljo there. Champ, Peter, number one, TJ2, Corey, Rob, Fob, Marlon, Jose. Oh, yeah, Jose Aldo, Pedro Munoz. Oh, we didn't even talk about that. Or is Did you see Cody Garbrandt call out TJ again? It's like, dude, you got knocked out. Just twice. Re- just Can you re- go to bed getting Seriously. knocked out three times by the same person? I, can you actually go to can you actually no, fall asleep? That guy's your dad at that point, I feel like. And you just I, mean, I don't the, know. The he, fact that he even called for it, I'm like Damn. Alright. I mean I'll watch. I would watch too. I'd watch. I don't think it would end any differently, but I I would definitely watch. Yeah. Um Wait, so who do you got Dude, I would list? I mean t- Cody could beat him hundred percent. Cause he's powerful. He's got a. He's got that little bang at him. But I think he's gonna go down to twenty five, and I think he'll have some good success at twenty five. He's not big. No. But neither's Peter Yawn. Like or Peter Yawn's five three. I guess TJ's thick, but TJ's short TJ, too. Yeah, TJ's TJ's not very. He's yeah, definitely thicker. Um, it's just weird that bantamweight because it literally goes from like five foot five to you at five foot eleven, six two, yeah, and six one or whatever, and everything in between, and, and everyone's it's still so dangerous type. in their I know, own it's ways. Crazy. It's crazy. Fighting is the coolest sport ever. Yeah. Well, jujitsu is the coolest sport ever, actually. I did jujitsu hard training yesterday for the first time since my fight, which was uh, fifteen days ago. I don't know, math is just stupid. <laughs> um, and it felt so good, dude. That release I got from hard grappling. You don't get it from running. You get a certain runner's high that does feel really good. You get a good, a different high from lifting, getting a good pump. It's like, oh, it feels good. But there's nothing better than a hard jujitsu practice. I swear to God, I'll put that on my daughter. <laughs> I'm getting that tatted, that whole thing I just said. I would. Yeah. On my back. There you go. <laughs> Dude, seriously, though, the jujitsu high you get from a good just training sash, <laughs> nothing like it, dude. And I've done a lot some stuff drug. no no no, no. It, experiences skydiving experiences uh, snorkeling tight roping over uh, Green uh canyon, Green canyon yep. snorkeling with the dolphins yeah i've done some stuff and that there's nothing like it not a high like it i swear wow. to god that's pretty cool yeah did you see steve bay's comment he said he might leave go to one he said it is unfair that um, DC got multiple rematches against him right as he wanted to, but he doesn't get the rematch no, against Nagano. You've missed so many funny things I've said. Yeah, Sorry. Not really. Um, it's like a comment. Did you hear me? Um, yeah, it's not fair DC got those rematches. And that, that he didn't get his against didn't. What do you think? And then, and then he commented like under a one championship, or he commented back at one saying, like, saying that. Yeah, I wonder. Because uh, one. UFC don't give up. Dude. That's true. They don't they give don't. a fuck. I could say I'm done fighting. They'd be like, "Cool, deuces." Yeah. Like I think they know the potential. I mean, that's right up. They'd be like, "No, no, no, please stay." Come on. No, but seriously, they don't give a fuck. If they're like, if Fran, if if Stipe says I'm going to one, dude, Dan would be like, "Cool, deuces." Damn, it's that's crazy. crazy. He's savage. He is. He don't care. I feel like um, he should. Maybe should he? I mean, he? yeah. I mean, dude, just Stipe Miocic. Uh, I think he's he a get legend. Match. I don't even know how they're having a freaking. Uh, Interim uh, belt. Interim title right now. <clears throat> that makes no sense to Dude, me. Dude, yeah, what? So who winner that fights Francis? So That's just unfair to Francis. I feel like well, he Francis has to refight for his title. Freaking, yeah. After like three months. Of- Tim and I were <gasps> talking about doing a potential live podcast. The Timbo Sugar Show live. Having like 500 people audience. Oh, really? I'd be nervous. You'd have to rent out something? 
we'd probably do it at the comedy show. Oh. I think that'd be like the, a perfect venue. But I would want it to be no cameras. Only no. recording is JX. So like yeah. we could post the episode. It'd be a live podcast. No cameras. And we can just let loose a little bit. Say some dark stuff. So is it, would it be like a podcast or a comedy it show? It would be a podcast. Because if I said it was a comedy, I'd be nervous. Like, oh, my God. Yeah. I'm making people laugh. But if it was a podcast, I'd be just like, well, they know what they're coming for. Right. Just great philosophical would you uh, would you allow would you allow crowd interaction or would you be like no oh no no q and a um yeah is this realistic oh yeah really dude it's the sugar show bud <laughs> yeah well, i'm building a sugar factory that would be pr- oh then you could have them in there if you yeah ever. that's the i mean I'm, the sugar factory will be i want to do it dude, I, I asked danny I said, you ever seen rob deardex the fantasy factory he said no not really I'm like, that's the idea. That's the that's what I want. That setup, dude, with offices. We got the podcast. We'll have to get the internet issue out. I'm gonna talk to Elon, see if we can figure something out. Um, talk to him. Yeah, because I'm still waiting on my Starlink. But like, so obviously, Ooh. Rob Deerdeck's main thing was like a skateboard, skate park. Yeah, I could skate. <laughs> You're not gonna put a skate park in dude, there. I've 100%. seen you shred. Not for me, for the boys. Who shreds? Dude, Tim loves skateboarding. Does he? A bunch of guys at the gym, dude. All those guys at the gym love skating. And they wow. just come fuck skate. Just skate. Right. Skate, bro. Let me watch. Yeah, well, bro. never mind. I'm I got wrong. a scooter. You seen it? Yeah, I have. You I need to get scooter. on. Speaking of Rob Deerdeck, you need to get on ridiculousness. That'd I be know. Fun. I, I, could, I could probably do that. I, I think we could make that happen, Rob Deerdeck. That Dude. shit's running on MTV 24 7. You'd be on. Hey, 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 yeah. Hey, there you hey. go. Ooh. Do you see how many views the Impulsive Podcast got with KSI? Like Nine point over 10 million. eight in one week, dude. But it was Jeez. up there in like two days. It was insane. Yeah, they're about to break their record, isn't of someone else was six had a big one. Yeah, six was I think the all time record leader. My boy, <laughs> that's my boy. Say it, talk shit, talk shit. We're pulling, we're pulling those numbers almost. Yeah, twelve, huh? forty-four. Um, I think once we get a guest or two on here, we'll enhance the numbers a little bit. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. I think uh, just clickbait. I'm fighting in December against. <gasps> Ooh. A thumbnail. Put your put your guess <laughs> put your guesses below. Yeah, we could Ooh. put some guesses. Uh yeah. who do you guys think? Who do you wanna see me fight? There's there's a lineup of people. Literally I could I could fight a bum on the street and you guys would watch. I've done it before. I feel like and then there's gonna be that one or couple people who are gonna comment Marab or some wrestler like why would you really want to Yeah, that's watch definitely that? not happening. Um fun to dude, watch. when I'm champ and those guys if then they can take make it up down. there, yeah. I'll take them out. But Gotta wait a little bit. Yeah. Um, Fortnite. You got a tournament coming up tomorrow. You a wizard? Yeah. And, uh, Clara. 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 Yeah. Yeah. We got a big Fortnite big tournament. Fortnite. How much money's on the line? Uh, I think there's a hundred k in uh, prizes. What's the realistic chance? Uh, like top ten? Oh no, 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 not for you guys. Like top ten prizes? Oh, probably top six. So you're confident. <laughs> I'm pretty confident. When I said top ten, you're no, <laughs> not us. Dude, no. Fortnite's a different. Those are different breed. Sixteen year olds. It's just on mouse and keyboard. Dude, the different. building. When someone yeah. just gets that good at building, it's like okay, you win. Bitch. And editing, yeah. No, That's so. why I stick to COD, where I am the man. Yeah. I got over two hundred dubs in birth, rebirth now. So damn. Yeah. Something we do. Um, we do. Shout out my boy Jinx, my boy CG. We were popping off today a little bit. Uh, what'd you drop? I, I I honestly my my highest kill game was like twelve. I didn't I wasn't playing that good. I got I went and hit mitts with Tim this morning just you doing elbows and knees and kicks, which was so fun. It was like no punches because my hands still sore. Yeah. So just doing uh, just getting ready for those little dudes coming just eating knees mm-hmm. for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, dude. Mm, and elbows. I'm gonna get too. such a nasty knee knockout, dude. I swear to God, it's gonna be the most. It's gonna be sweet. Um, do you train like a Muay Thai with anyone or is it no, kind of like a I knock in? Muay Thai fighters out. Look at Thomas Ame is a Muay Thai. I knock, dude, there's, I don't have a style. There's yeah. not a name for it. It's sugar, dude. That's sweet. It. There's literally sweet. no one. You can't go and look at someone and be like, oh, that's similar ish, like ish, but I'm different. I'm quicker. I'm faster. My eyes are better. But DC did compliment your eyes. I mean, he, he's high. Yeah. He know. He sees, he sees like. Sees the day. What was I talking about? Oh yeah, what we did today. Hit mitts and then uh Oh yeah, well, I was why well, didn't play very good today. Mm-hmm. Hit mitts. I didn't eat anything this morning because someone likes to sleep in as late as possible, Novia. I always get up with Elena in the mornings, take her outside. It's actually really fun. I enjoy it. But sometimes when Danny sleeps in too late, I don't get breakfast because I don't make myself <laughs> food. I'm pathetic. Tough lies. But I had, I could have had some cereal, but uh 
Elena's a lot of work, man. Yeah. Um, and then so I didn't eat this morning. And then right after hitting mids, Danny, or we got a little burrito from Driftwood, and uh, Oof. it was good, but it was small. It's like, dude, what am I five? Like, I need four of these. Like, <laughs> why didn't you order it? four of them? Let it. Mariah ordered them before uh-huh. and then brought them over. Shout out, Mariah. LOL. Um, <laughs> uh, we got this on Apple and Spotify. Oh, yeah. You did that today. Apple yeah. and Spotify. So uh, I yeah. guarantee ain't nobody going to listen to that. They want to see. No, they're going to listen. Me. We're going to pull some crazy no, they numbers. They want to see the visual. They want to see how good I look today. Well, you could put visuals you on said, Spotify, can you? Oh, yeah. Joe Rogan has done Joe that. Does. No, I think that's lit, though. Apple, Spotify. Um, and then you can you can find out where the views and stuff are, the downloads and stuff. Yeah, you can see the analytics on this. Damn. Analytics. So we'll see if you guys are listening on yeah. YouTube. Even if you are listening on, uh, go click on it. Uh, give me that ad revenue. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> go get Comment, a follow. Subscribe. Make your mom watch. No, don't. So, oh, Danny, we have a uh, we have an audience question. Uh, Novia, uh, floor is yours. Um. She froze. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, Daniel, yeah. Daniel said that, like so many people did. Like, oh, really? like probably six to eight hundred people said made it. Damn. But I don't know if some of you guys just saw everyone like, was oh, made it. And maybe like, oh, made it, made but it. Made it. But that's pr- they might have. I don't skip to the end anyone's videos. They might have. <laughs> no. Uh, what have you been watching on YouTube lately? Me? Yeah. No. No. What? Well, we have a fan in the audience. Two fans. Three. Uh, what have you been watching on uh, YouTube? <sighs> Who? I can't say I've been watching too much. I've really? Been, uh, i just been watching Twitch. I just, wa- I just throw on Twitch. Who have you been just... watching? Mercs? No, I haven't been watching Mercs. I've Damn. been a- acting like Tommy, the old guy. Yeah, he's plays pretty funny. I watched a couple of him. <laughs> and then just like... um, I, co- I think I commented one time. I said, let's go. And someone said, no one knows who the fuck you are. Huh? I was oh, like, there you go. Damn. I'm not watching anymore. I just got roasted. I was trying to hype. I was hype, dude. He was f- hilarious. He's funny. But I don't watch anymore because that guy been watching scared me. Um, I've been watching Steve's Steve's older stuff because I never really watched a ton of it. But now I'm going back. I'm like, he's got some funny shit. Dude. Has he? Oh, my God. It's, and he posts, like, there's so much shit on there. He's hilarious. Uh, I've been watching Steve. What else have I been watching? Um, I watched the Impulsive one, KSI, a little bit. Didn't finish that yet. Um, I bet if we just thought of Sean O'Malley highlights and shit. <laughs> I bet you did. I seriously watched every video on myself out there. That's not. I mean, it's just what it is. Ooh, I want to rewatch your. Fight I've been with saying you. those since the day one. I'm my biggest fan. You are. Like I've said that since I was an amateur. Like, I was like, there's nobody that likes watching me more than me, and I'm not a narcissistic. <laughs> I'm narcissistic. stick. Just a little bit. Ow, fuck. I wasn't like doing. That. Damn, yeah. Ever since you started putting those ads in the... Ow, oh, fuck. Dude, don't tell them. Mm. Yeah, so... Um, <laughs> what time is it? 9.05. Yeah, we were supposed to be start at 7. It's 9 now. Thank you, Yasada. And I'm super hydrated because I had to fuck, drink a lot of water. Now i got to pee again. Um, so we're on Apple. We're on Spotify. You're giving out the hoodie. Yeah. Um, okay, you, yeah. Who, message me. Who should we? Who? Oh yeah. Who else message you again? They probably remember it. Actually, you don't got yeah, time. Um. So we got two hoodies here. Let's give another one away. What size? Are they both larges? Uh. Yeah. Oh no, this one's a medium. Okay. So you can ask that kid if he's a medium or a large. Whoever okay. First, and then who else? Who? Who? What should we have someone say or do? Um. Some funny. I no. like laughing. I like dark humor where you say it and you're like oh god i just kind of feel sick to myself i shouldn't have said that but it was funny like that's kind of humor i like but i can't, I can't you can't do stuff you get canceled oh i told mom today i said uh one of my main goals is just to get like a sick uh uh what's that called mug shot sick mug shot it's, it's bound to happen honestly. well i hit up logan i said dude i'm going to the fight you're going to the fight if I don't leave with a mug shot, we didn't do it right. In, I said that in a poem. In Cleveland? Yeah. You're going? Yeah, going. I didn't know if you were going. Last time I talked to you, you said you weren't, don't know if you were going. No, I'm deaf going 100 That'd be MV. sweet. Mug shot? You could use our brothers. Uh, Yeah, that's true. Michael does have uh, plenty of <laughs> mug shots. He's got like seven DYs. I'm like, what's the, what's the something I could do to go to jail where it's not 
bad. I don't want to be a bad citizen. I don't want to, oh, you know what I mean, like yeah. ruin anyone's day or. Well, you can get arrested, I think, for intoxication, like public intoxication. I feel or like cops like don't even peeing, care at this point. I'll pee on a car. You could no, not a car. I could pee on a car and they'd be like, get or a pee outside and they'd be like, get out of here. I'm like, no, no, I'm not doing it. <laughs> I'm not getting out <laughs> of here. I'm not doing it. You're going to have to arrest me. Pee, they're like, you're done peeing. I'm like, yeah, but here's my wiener. Just flopping <laughs> it around. Public uh, indecency, I think. Yeah. But I, I can't, I got to do something that's not going to affect anything, my career or anything. I mean, John Jones did coke and ran into a pregnant lady. I think I could still get a fight after a decent exposure. Yeah. Just don't do it in front of like kids or anything or children. Dude, like, I'm saying if you're out dude, walking in the park. Dude, no. you think I'm going to go to a park and shove my wiener? <laughs> I've seen you do some pretty crazy stuff. You never stuff. seen me do anything like that. Well, <laughs> that's some crazy stuff. Uh, but not yet. Um, we'll just yeah, I'll, I'll definitely d- avoid parks. Uh, I'm just saying, what if you're... <laughs> I'm hospitals saying. all right yeah no i don't know that's silly stuff i don't know that's something i can think of something i can maybe you guys can tell me in the comments how can i get arrested without <laughs> how can i get arrested without being a bad citizen i don't want to i just want a sweet mug shot i was thinking what if i had like <laughs> 10 pounds of weed and it would be that'd be that would be good no or that, coke that could be no, like i'm kidding, pretty I'm kidding. <laughs> that would not be good that would definitely no. not be good i, I need something simple <laughs> like a dui or something <laughs> no, DUIs are still. People. I do. Still that's people. like the. That's horrible. I don't want a DUI. Um, well, Asian massage. No, I didn't know. I didn't know. I swear. I swear. I didn't know. No, she was no. wearing lingerie and held my hand all the way back to the room. I didn't know. I swear. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you can get arrested for what you're saying. I'm a comedian. I'm literally making up stories in my head, and I'm a comedian. That's what we do. Look at my Instagram. It says comedian. <laughs> I swear it? to God. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, you're crazy. All right, how long we've been? Did we click record? I guarantee you forgot to click record. I feel yeah, like. Oh my god, that's like so long. Huh? All right, comment away. You guys can come up with a good rap line. Wait, what? Oh, dude, someone. Yeah, that's another. That's a, a really verse? good idea. Like a whole verse. I want a whole song. <laughs> No, yeah, give me a couple verses on the in the comments. Maybe we can do that for next one. This one, just comment some. A way I can get arrested where it's not bad. And am I actually going to? No. This is all entertainment. I'm out. Uh, you win a sweatshirt if you fi- if I find the best way to get arrested without being a bad person. Comedy. Not actually going to do it. Um, episode 65. 25. 20, 25. In the books. In the books. It's just a number. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Tune it in. Tune it in. Tune it in. Tune it in.